so much for watching my videos. Now I'm super excited because this is a Dollar Tree a DIY um, Christmas challenge. So Gina Schweppe, who's another fellow YouTuber and a couponer, and if you have not subscribed or checked out her channel, check it out. That'll be in the description box and also at the end of this video. Um, she did an open collab, which I absolutely love because it's just not all big YouTubers. It could be somebody with 52 subscribers to 100,000 subscribers. So that's what's great about one thing that I love about Gina is that she loves to spread the love and work with even the smallest of channels to the largest of channels. And I feel the same way too. If somebody reaches out to me and wants to do a collab, and even if they have 100 subscribers, I'm like, yes, no problem. Love helping other people. And I love that about her. And she started her own non um, started her own nonprofit. She had one in the other state she lived in. She's starting to start one in California. She's a California girl now like me. And she's actually probably about... 20 minutes away from me if I go on the freeway. She's in, um, I'm in Orange County and she's in Orange County as well, but on the other side. So it's just like a hop, skip and a jump on the freeway from her. So hopefully we can link up soon, Gina. We need to link up soon. Um, so she did this two, $10 challenge. I said, I'd be happy to do it. She did it on her video. She posted a video and I'm like, yeah, I'm down. I'm totally down to do it. So it's working with $10 from and taking it to Dollar Tree and just trying to make a gift together that's inexpensive, but it still looks nice and something that you would want to give to somebody. So I came up with something. I hope you guys like it. I think it came out super duper cute. And yeah, let's go ahead and take a look. And uh, yeah, don't forget to check out Gina's channel. And let's take a look. I even showed you guys how I made it, how you can do it too. And maybe you can go out to Dollar Tree and copy my gift and give it to somebody who needs it for Christmas or donate it or a friend, family member, neighbor, doesn't matter. Okay, let's take a look at this video. Okay, so this is what I came up with for my $10 Dollar Tree gift Christmas challenge. So the first thing I did was I picked up one of these glitter bags. Now you don't have to pick a glitter bag. You can use one of the um, Dollar Tree. They have gift boxes. They have all kinds of stuff. Um, and you don't have to do it on this large of a scale. I'm just using this because they had some at my Dollar Tree still. So hopefully they still have some for yours too. Now I'm going to shrink wrap this and I always use the shrink wrap pull and bolt from Dollar Tree. So that's $2 already out of my $10 budget. Now what I did is I add cardboard and don't worry this won't show because I'm gonna put tissue on top. I hope it doesn't show. We'll we'll work with it if it does. Um, so I put cardboard on the side and right here just to hold the shape of the package. Now, if you don't put cardboard, it's gonna get lumpy and hard to shrink wrap. So I definitely recommend cutting some cardboard. It's not hard to do. Cutting some cardboard, putting it on the sides here, here, and here, and then filling it with newspaper. Now I have some newspaper from couponing because I'm a couponer, of course. I'm gonna fill this up with newspaper and I'm gonna add tissue on top and then we'll continue from there. I to go with the Bolero, the new Bolero line that is out at Dollar Tree right now. Rather than trying to pick some items that there you guys may not have in your store so hopefully you guys have some of these bolero items if you don't they have a ton of different options and things to choose from from the dollar tree now these are all from the dollar tree so the um soap the, the coconut and vanilla cream soap is from the dollar tree we have a bath visor from the dollar tree we have some body wash from the dollar tree we have the foot scrub the face wipes some lotion a package a three pack of bath bombs and then we also have the cooling cucumber eye mask so that is everything and i'm going to fix this up i'll probably tape this down that is going to be in this package i think it looks really cute i might add some cardboard on this side because i didn't do that and then i'll show you guys what the final product looks like i'll also show you guys how to shrink wrap in case you're wondering but let me mess around with this a little bit more and make it look a little bit more stable tape this down i think that would be best if i tape this down like this if i tape it down and then i think it'd be a really cute gift and this cost me exactly ten dollars so a dollar for the um basket a dollar for the shrink wrap and then i have one two three four five six seven eight dollars in regular dollar tree items so really really cute gift inexpensive this is a nice spa gift you can give to a mother an aunt a niece um somebody at work a co-worker if you don't have a lot of money this is a nice gift to give to somebody so uh, let me go ahead and mess around with this a little bit more figure out how i want to shrink wrap it and then once i'm ready to shrink wrap i'll show you guys how i shrink wrap my gift shrink wrap my gifts hey guys so this is everything that is going to be in my little ten dollar challenge i did tape that and i think once i shrink wrap it it's going to close like this i did add cardboard on the side and in the back it helped out a lot to keep the integrity of the box keep it nice and straight 
it didn't move around so much and stuff like that. And when you shrink wrap this, everything's gonna stay in its place, so that's always great. Now what I use is, this is from the Dollar Tree, it's the shrink wrap pull and bow. You can usually find this in the gift wrapping section where the cellophane and stuff is. Um, it's a great, it's a bag, so all you do is open the bag, you're gonna put your package in the bag. This in the bag like so. I think it looks really, really good. And then all I'm going to do is I am going to start blow drying this. Now I use a heat gun because it's just faster, but you can certainly use a blow dryer and that's gonna give you the shrink wrap effect. So what you wanna do is start blow drying from the bottom up. So let me get my heat gun and we'll get started so with I that. I started my shrink wrapping process. I worked from the bottom and then I worked my way up. And it's very easy to use. The instructions are on the bag for Dollar Tree. Really, really easy to use. So I'm gonna continue with my shrink wrapping. I don't have my husband here to hold the camera to show you, but I've showed it in other of my, of my DIY videos. So if you wanna go back and look at some of those, those are some other um, really great inexpensive gift ideas. But um, my husband is not here to hold the camera so I can show you guys. So I'm just gonna continue working my way up and then we're going to use the bow that comes with this. Normally I would probably put either a green or red bow, but I'm already at my $10 budget. So I'm just gonna use the bow that is provided in the bag. So that's great that you get the bow and the bag. So not a bad deal on that. Let me continue and then I'll show you guys what the final product is going to look like. What the final product looks like after it's been shrink wrapped. The box worked out perfectly. It did hold its integrity. So I really like that I should have used a, a larger um, piece of cardboard right here but that is okay it looks really really nice it's a very nice gift it looks like it costs way more than ten dollars I love the box the box is actually reusable um, the products in there are super nice I've heard great things about Bolero products so this is a nice inexpensive gift to give away to somebody who um, who's in your family or a friend or a co-worker a neighbor these are great like little just inexpensive gifts that are not gonna break your bank, but are still nice to give out. Now, I hope you guys are having a fabulous, blessed day. Thank you so much for watching my videos. Don't forget to check out Gina Schweppe's channel. Her information will be in the description box, and it's also probably popped up on one of the little screens that you see at top. I'll also link her at the end of this video so you guys can take a look at her. She's going to list everybody that's doing this $10 challenge, so it'll be really great to see and interesting to see what everybody else comes up with. This is just one of my ideas. Is. There are so many more that I have in this brain of mine that I'm going to be doing throughout the whole entire month of end of November and beginning of December, just so you guys can get some ideas of how you can save money and still gift somebody a really nice gift, even if you're on a very tight budget. So you guys have a fabulous blessed day and I will be talking to you guys real soon. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.